guys, it's Schleck Roses, and today I am doing a gigantic unboxing of all this amazing stuff that I got from Schleck in their stock up sale. All right, let's get started. Oh, first we have paper, it's my favorite. Okay. Um, so let's grab what I'll say first. So I have this beautiful Hanoverian mare, the retired one, and um, comes with the rider and the tack. It's really pretty, I think. So I got four, I think four of these. So I'm gonna sell the tack and probably the rider on my Etsy and then I'm gonna customize the horse most likely. I'm gonna start with the first thing I like was opening and then I will move forward. Right. Love unboxing. What are these twisty things? These twisty things are not my friends. Okay, and twist, and twist, and twist, and twist. Yeah, these are not fun. Six and a half hours later. Guys, I did it. I'm a magician. All right, so here we have our beautiful, lovely horse, beautiful, lovely rider, beautiful tack, and finally our beautiful Hanoverian mare. So pretty. I have this is the Hanoverian pasture family set. I already have all these models, so what I'm probably gonna do is either keep it and sell it later on or um customize all of them and because i really like yeah i'm not sure exactly what i'm gonna do with all these but okay so it comes with a bunch of scents which i always need so awesome it comes with some feed it comes with hay bale little grain little carrot and little apples and then Oh, thank God, they're not packaged in twist ties. We have our beautiful horses, and I don't know if there's anything else in here, but I'm just gonna make sure. Okay, now we All right. So, he is adorable. He's like one of my favorite models, actually. Um, I know he wasn't in my top 10, but like, he's still, he's really cute. I love like just his color and everything. It's really pretty. It looks like a little troublemaker. I don't know why. I just like that face. Troublemaker. And then this lovely girl. Who I have like so many of. Okay. Um, and then I got fence. Three, I think three boxes of fences. And these were like the safari ones. But I actually kind of like these. Um, for like some of the small animals that I have. So I'll probably use those in my barn. So that will definitely be a change in the barn door. Oh wow, that is bigger than I thought. I was not expecting it to be that big. I was like, well, maybe it'll be like that long. It's pretty big. Let's see what the doors look like. This, this looks like it goes around and then there's like an opening, I think. So like these are, this is a half door and then there's another one and it just like opens, I guess. Well, these will be featured in the next barn tour. Um, this is the leaf feed set. Normally, I mean, I guess I could put this as like the bunnies, probably. And then this is like the trees, uh, to tree set. Um, just like little plastic trees, I guess. So, I guess those are something I'm gonna. Cause these are really, really pretty. Beautiful. This box is actually really cute. I'm gonna definitely use this for my feed room. There's a darker green one and a lighter green one. 
Now we're going to open the trees branches. And we have some three more leaves and more leaves and another branch. I should have gotten more of these, dang it. Hi guys. Okay. And this I'm really excited to open. This is like the, um, the, it's like the last thing in the pony, um, training set that I need to complete like the full set. So I was really excited to get this. Um, because I have the other two ones, so, and this is like the exclusive pony, so I'm excited to see that. Um, and everything else is like single horses. Pony thingy. Open! Fancy. Oh, I see some part of the, the jumpy thingy, the hole for the, there it's the, what a cute pony! I love her in this color. I just need this piece of cardboard, but I will keep this. Because mommy said, good idea. Okay. So what we have here? Oh, we're supposed to put these stickers on. So you guys, I've learned we should probably read these directions, even though it doesn't look that complicated. You never know. Okay. Do I have a pair of scissors? I guess we're just gonna have to not use scissors. Oh, that works too. Okay, all right. Why? Open. Are those sticks? Not perfect, but you know what? It's gonna work. I wasn't done with them. Oh, crap. I literally... Why do I always lose everything I'm doing in these videos? Like, I have one job. Not blind, promise. Also not perfect, but don't care. Oops. These two sticks like this. Yes. And then this goes. Mm, I hit my finger. Okay. There we go. Okay. And now we put on the little stand. I love this coloring on her so much more than the original. Oh my goodness. But now I have two. Okay, this is very nice. I like it very much. And this is the final thing I need for my pony thing. Wee. Okay. Wee. Okay, no. First one that I got was the Morgan Mare because I kind of wanted to get her. I'm not like too big of a fan of her painting, so I'm probably going to repaint her. Um, but, like, her, I feel like her mold was, like, okay, so I was, like, mm, maybe I'll just get it and customize it. First one, the Morgan Mare, which we already discussed. It's, like, a carroty color. I'm really not a big fan of, like, the, how distinct this is. I'm not sure that's very realistic. Um. Uh, her eyeballs are very big. She doesn't have a lot of definition like on this side of her body, but she's all right. We can make this work. And I like her, I like her braids, her braids are pretty. This is the Black Arabian Stallion. He's pretty nice actually, I like the coloring on him. Yeah, he's cute. There's a light pink on his tail. I think that, yeah, it's like a light pink peach. Could definitely play off something for a blanket with that is the black Hanoverian mare and i kind of already have a black Hanoverian mare but i think i'm going to start a conga because i was actually at trash supply and they had them for like two dollars each on clearance so i think i got i got four of them i thought she was black 
just like a dark gray, I kind of think, or maybe it's just a gray. Um, just, yeah, kind of like a dark gray. Oh my god, how'd you get that white on you? I just took you out of the freaking package. Um, yeah, it's kind of pretty. I don't know why that's white there, but we'll go with it. Exclusive model. So this is like the the beige retainer uh, stallion. And like, I haven't taken him out of the packaging, but just like right now, he looks very orange. So let's hope he's not a carrot pony. Yeah, he's very orange. Very orange. He looks very orange. Why does he look so orange? Yeah, I wonder where this was painted. This was probably painted and not somewhere good. I've seen pictures of people who have like the same model, but they were painted in different places. It's actually interesting. I'm gonna guess China, yeah, China. But some of them, I say they're like made in Portugal and sometimes they're painted a little bit better. So, carrot boy year. Yeah. So I've got an Icelandic stallion and I already have one of him. So I'm gonna custom one or keep a, keep on to it. It just holds a lot of value. Um, but I was really upset because I actually ordered four of him and I only got one because I got like a message from Schleich saying that they didn't have enough in stock. And I was like, but I ordered four and it said I could. So <laughs> yeah, but it's okay. I got refunded for it. I'm so... A little salty. The Frisian mare, the new one. And I've seen so many pictures of her, but like I've been waiting so long because for some reason I can't find these anywhere. Like the Frisian mare, I just can't find her anywhere. So I got her. Okay, this is the Frisian mare. Let's look at it. That is a fancy mane. Look at that. That's a very, um, I feel like it's almost like too thick. I don't know. Wow, that is a very rope-like tail. I don't know how I feel about that. I like how her fetlocks are braided. It's great. Wonderful. Uh, altogether, I'm not like, you know, I'm like, okay. It's not terrible. Not my favorite model though either. So now it's like bulging. See that? It's weird. A lot of hair. It's a little smurf and I was like, wait, hold on. I did not order a smurf. What is this? And then, um, so it says thank you. So this is like a little thank you gift, I guess. So it was like, hmm, yay. And now there's two of the same thing. So I'll like open one, I think. And then the other one's the same. So she's beautiful. Okay. So, oh, oh, it does have packaging on it. I was like, it's all I thought. Okay, so this is like the, um, does it have a name? I don't know, it's just like a collector set, I guess. The exclusive Tinker Mare. That is the Mustang Stallion. That's a exclusive Tennessee Walker Mare. That's the Tinker Stallion. I mean, Tinker Bowl, Jesus. Yes, that is a stallion. And then I don't know what this full is, actually. And my, oh, this must be the Tennessee Walker full, which I actually don't have, so, yeah. And there's two of these guys. So, I was like, one I'll get and just probably, because there's some, like, I have this model already, so I'll probably custom him. I have this full already, so I'll probably custom him, and then I'll probably keep these two since they're kind of, like, exclusively models. I'm not sure if I'm going to open the other one or not, but... Possibly or possibly not. I don't know. Okay. How's this gonna work? Okay. Oh my god. There are so many of them. Oh no. Look at all of them. Oh. It's gonna take forever. And um, what did they do? Have backup. One eternity later. But actually, that took tw 20 minutes. I'm serious. So this guy is super duper cute. I have I didn't have him before, and I really like him. He's like in the cutest little pose. He's like, so I really like him. 
and this mare, I don't know, I have mixed feelings about her. I kind of like her original recolor more than, than this one, but I think it's okay. And the Tinker Mare recolor, I'm in love with. I really, really like her um, with this black coloration. It's really pretty. I like love this one. Definitely recommend it. If you were to choose one out of all of them that come in that set, like this one is the one that I really like the most. But she will be painted soon. Okay, and then I guess she probably opened this mouth up just because she did come. This, all this stuff, so much stuff. So I know you guys have seen everything already, but just another look. Here's all the horses and the fence. And some more horses, some accessories, some more horses. And more horses I'm probably not going to unbox right now because that literally took forever. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this gigantic unboxing. And if you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. And check out my Etsy because I have a ton of stuff listed up on there. There's something on my face. Okay, there's a ton of stuff listed up there. And... There's so much you can get. There's blankets. There are bundles that come with some horses that are like um, original finish horses. And then there's some customs. There's literally so much there. And I'm adding listings all the time once stuff gets purchased. So go make those purchases. Mwah.